see, I've been playing for as long as I can remember, really. I think I was about four or five, talking out for the under sixes, playing with lads that were older than me, but kind of, I've been used to that, really. I've been doing it all my life. There's just like a whole bunch of lads there in Cappy, and they just do it because they love it. And they're just very good trainers. Like They take, take age groups there when they have no children in them, so it makes it an awful lot harder as well for them to get trains and matches, but they do it because they love it and they just try to build, build players to come up to the senior team and build the club. Coaches were Mr Williams and Mr Cooney. I've played in the Junior B team. We won, we won the Junior B Championship and I've been centre forward and we also made it to the semi-final of the Senior B but we lost to Callis Anxious unfortunately. It was kind of a stretch through 2019 where I was just hurling very bad. I got dropped off the minors and I got injured and I was just playing very bad for club as well and it's like tough to keep going but kind of family and club you don't want to let anyone down so I kind of just started training harder and just playing a lot more at home like I'm practicing and kind of all worked out in the end just have to keep it going for yourself really like other lads will just pass you out if you don't do it so just we had like a home gym really made out of stuff we could find anything we could find at home really and just up at the pitch or down at the down the road running and we also did challenges in the group with our team like to keep the kind of team spirit going but it's hard enough there's only so much you can do playing against the wall the match matches are a whole lot different but everyone was in the same boat really so once once we got back training then we just had to focus on getting back up to championship level as quick as possible. Just practice and this, it's all about practice at the end of the day. Like if you want to if you want to be the best or you want to make it onto a county team you're gonna to have to work for it. and just play with a smile on your face as well really. Just enjoy the hurling. If you like hurling just practice a lot and it'll happen. Um, just I couldn't believe it really it just after winning the All Ireland final. And that's the most important thing at the end of the day, like all the awards or the goal, like they're just add-ons. And just the main thing is winning. And it's just unbelievable, like a dream come true. Like at the start of the year, I didn't really think I was gonna even be starting. And it's just to get player of the year now, it's a dream come true. It's also it's also great for me to be able to follow in the footsteps of my uncles, uh, John, Owen and David, and play for Garbley and play for Galway because they also had great success in the past with Gerbley. I'd like to thank my family really and my parents most of all because they're the ones who bring us to the trainings and the matches and they ask for nothing in return, they do it because we love it. Um, our management team like in the county was very good, they were always so nice you could go to them with anything and in the club as well since I was under six all the way to playing now with the seniors like everyone's always there to help, they always support you and in the school as well. We have trainers there in the school that just love hurling like and everyone will back you.